Welcome back to Need for Speed Heat. Today we're going to be doing another off-road build, this time with the BMW X6M. So we currently have a 567 horsepower 4.4 liter V8. Our potential horsepower can go up to just over a thousand, so I don't think we're going to swap this engine for off-road, honestly no need to go super crazy with the power oh wow if we really wanted to go crazy though we could throw the forged v8 in here holy smokes all right so we got our ultimate parts on here and we were able to bring this bad boy up to uh, just over a thousand horsepower zero to 60 is now 3.03 seconds and our top speed is 220 miles an hour Oh, well, there we go. We have a super rally that we already own. So let's go ahead and equip that bad boy. Brakes, we're definitely going to want to improve those. Tires, we'll go with the off-road tires. Oh, we could throw a race dip on here. Bring us all the way over there. I think we will try that. All right, so that takes care of the performance. Should be just fine for the off-road races. Now let's see what we can do in terms of customization here. All right, uh, I think that completes the build here. Let's see how she does out in some races. All righty, well, we are gonna start off getting a feel for this car here uh, by going to get some collectibles and stuff that I have not got yet. So, awkward cars are perfect hey, for that. What's up? Hey, All right, here we go. Let's see. Uh, I think we got it. Look how far that bottom wheel's coming out. Holy smokes. I didn't have enough speed and I wanted to bail out and uh, did it too late. Can we climb up this hill? Can we climb up this hill? No, no, you can do it. Okay, it's not gonna happen. If you're not using off-road cars that often, do yourself a favor and start to explore the map because there is so much you are missing out on if you're not taking an off-road car and just driving around all over the place. Wow, that's quite a lot of airtime. Holy smokes. All right, so unlike uh, some of the last couple off-road builds that we've done where we were just like way over level for the races, we're a little bit uh, more evenly matched, so it should make these more competitive. And hopefully more fun. Okay, maybe I should have put the, uh, the bigger tank in here. I just left the stock one because I was like, eh, for off-road races, you don't need it as much. But uh, I should have put it on, I guess. What lap are we on? Oh, this is the final lap. We're going to come in second here. But I guess that's a nice change of pace because we've been crushing it lately. Sucks because I don't get as much money, though. That's for sure. 